Hey guys, so I decided to go um, and have a chat to some people in my neighborhood to see what they thought about wastewater management um, and social media. So yeah. Uh, no. No. Oh, yeah? No, I wouldn't say it was a few posts on Facebook. Yeah. I can't think, but okay. I don't look that much. No. 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 I had a friend who worked in waste management, she talked a little bit about it before, yeah. and that was quite interesting, but um, I guess it would be good to know what's happening. Yeah, And so you would be, you would like to learn more about it, like you yeah, would, if someone yeah. put it in a format that you'd be interested in, yeah. you'd, you'd engage with it. Yeah, especially like, if, as t in teaching, it would be good to teach kids to know exactly what's happening if they just see the end result. Got a fair bit of knowledge on it already, which I don't know. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Is that from more. working? Ah, oh, just yeah, knowing people who do it. And, yeah, okay. Grey water. And so all that more word stuff. of word of mouth. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. <coughs> Being right. old enough to know that know it exists, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Would you consider like you wouldn't go online to look for more information? I would if I was uh, intending on building a property to use it. Yeah. Yeah. To cool. Research and make sure setting up the right, right systems and stuff like that. Cool. Make it the most efficient I can. Yeah, sweet, thanks. Yeah, sure. Yeah. That's interesting. Yeah, why not? Yeah. yeah. Do you feel like you have a good knowledge of like wastewater? No, really. No. Nah. No. I heard something about and heard, heard people talking about, but yeah. don't really have much okay. um, knowledge about that. W what do you think would kind of make you want to learn more? Do you think there's anything that will kind of trigger you to be like, oh, I want to find out more? Uh, yes. Like yeah. if I find interesting and then I understand that I'm interested in uh, these kind of things. So yes, then I will search more information on the internet cool. and click more yeah. videos and yeah, get more uh, information about this. Yeah. yeah. Like, is there any particular area that you know of that you might? Um, I probably don't know enough about it to yeah. know what particular area, but I definitely would be interested. If I yeah. Had cool. Access to that. Yeah, so have you ever heard like much about wastewater recycling? Uh, a little bit, probably more from the news than anything. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so not yeah. from like online. No. Yeah. No. Um, and like what are your feelings about it? Um, I think it's a good idea, obviously, that's yeah. going to be helpful for the environment. Like I suppose I've become a lot more aware of what my environmental impacts are. Yeah. So if it was something that was going to help with that, yeah, definitely. Yeah, be you'd be keen. Yeah. yeah. Not worried about the yuck factor. No, not really, no. Cool. So I think the moral of the story um, from talking to, to people is that there is not enough wastewater content on social media, uh, whether that's because it's not interesting enough and it's not getting shared and um, spread, or whether it just doesn't exist in the first place. And also from chatting to a variety of different people, it's clear that there is a need for lots of different types of um, content on social media, whether it be educational, or like age appropriate teaching materials, to practical, informative content, to just interest pieces that, that spark people's imagination and attract their attention um, to, to take them on that little educational journey themselves. Cool. Thanks for listening.